Hi YouTubers, Lil Owl Thrifter here. I'm going to be showing you um, a purchase I made, a jewelry purchase from a fellow YouTuber, uh, the Cincinnati Picker. So he bought a few storage units and he was trying to get rid of all his items. Um, and I contacted him and purchased a uh, two five pound uh, jewelry lots um, one five pound uh, jewelry lot was sixty dollars and I was very happy with the purchase so I bought another one <laughs> so this uh, first video I might do two um, this is from the ten pounds that I received and uh, I thought $60 for five pounds of jewelry was a great price. And I got some great pieces, and I'm going to share that with you today. So, yeah, I came across a lot of good stuff. Um, I'll just start showing you what I got. I got, you know, um, Trafari and... Um, I found a couple sterling pieces and uh, uh, coro. I found some uh, rhinestones and um, just a lot of good pieces. So um, first off, I found these. Um, these are Trafari gold tone. They're pierced. And I thought they were the prettiest things. You see them? Very, very pretty. Then I came across this pin. Um, it's a road runner vintage pin. Hope you can see it okay. Let me get my uh, magnifying glass. Because I'm going to read to you what the back of that, whoops, sorry, I hit the camera. Um, this piece is Florenta of California, and it's dated 1970. Um, then I found these, uh, this pair of... Uh, pierced earrings. It's marked um, M M N S N. It could be the artist, but they are sterling. They're marked 925. Very pretty. I think that's glass. And they're pierced. Really pretty. Um, this is a unique piece. This is a choker, and um, it has uh, an elephant pendant. Very light metal. I thought that was really cool. Just a lot of nice pieces. Um, this is marked uh, 925. It's a bracelet. It's also marked... Um, Saki, S-A-K-I, which is a good brand, and little, um, like crystal beads, or glittery beads, and, uh, it is Mark Sterling. So if you go to my eBay store, you'll find, uh, these items, uh, for sale on there. I haven't gotten, um... These first few pieces I'm showing you are already on my store. Um, then there's going to be other pieces. They're not on my store yet. Um, I've been showing some. I'm also on Instagram. So uh, if you see a piece you like, then of course I'll give you a better deal. Um, just contact me below. There's an email address on my YouTube, uh, in the description box. 
Um, also, I found a um, watch. It's like a Native American watch. It's sterling silver, and it is uh, Francisco. Now, they have various watches with different designs on the watch. And uh, some say R Francisco, or um, I believe it's S Francisco. Um, I don't know if it's a family um, of artists that make these. Um, but, you know, there's various different, like, this is all brown tones. Um, there's some black in there, beige, some, you know, neutral colors. Then they have some that have blue. Um, but it's really nice. The face is a little scratched up, but right in there, I don't know if it's going to show up, but right in there it says Francisco, and it's Mark Sterling. Um, I found this um, bear pin, B-A-U-E-R. Uh, this is all... It looks like uh, the rhinestones, but it also looks like Aurora Borealis um, to me, but a <laughs> cute frog. Very sparkly. Um, then I came across this um, sterling cat bracelet. It needs a bit of uh, shining up, but... Um, it's a bracelet, and then there's a little kitties. That I have like three watchers on it already. Um, I found this brooch. Oh, as a matter of fact, uh, it's B O U G H E R. These pieces are uh, sought after. Um, I think those are real pearls if I'm not mistaken this is gold tone but it is damaged see the brooch and then the back um, it is uh, broken off there that's really pretty someone might be able to uh, repair that there so I better put that aside I hope I listed that that was broken I'm pretty sure I did but um, so then I found some laurel birch pins. Um, I'm also selling a laurel birch hat, sun hat. But, you know, there's laurel birch clothing. Um, she has uh, various uh, things she sells. But these pins, um, you have the snake, um, birds and those are dogs when I looked at them real quick I thought they were cats but the name of that um, pen is called the mythical dogs so these are the mythical dogs I'm selling these all together then um, these are the celestial birds I'm pretty sure yep And then this is Snake. I saw somebody bought this for 45 or it sold for 45 So that's that. Um, then I came across, let me see if I can find it. I kind of went through all this and separated it. Um, but when I come across it, I'll show you. It's not in this video. I'll show you in the next one. Um, it was a really pretty. Uh, oh, here it is. This was so pretty. I might keep this for myself. <laughs> this is a sterling necklace. It looks vintage. Um, it's like thin. Uh, Sterling silver. It's marked sterling uh, here and here. But look how delicate and pretty that is. Is it coming up shiny? Yeah. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? And it's marked 
uh, right here on the end over here. But oh, that they're just so pretty. So that I might keep for myself. I love sterling. That's my favorite type of jewelry. Um, I came across this uh, garnet set. These are genuine uh, garnet with gold tone. I uh, hope you can see there. I should have brought in my other light. But um, this is the necklace, earrings, and a pen. And this is a little paper that comes with it. And it says, uh, Qual Quality Assurance Certificate. I, the undersigned hereby guarantee the quality of the enclosed crimson treasures, genuine garnet, pendant earrings, and bar pen. Uh, R. Dill Kincaid, CEO of JJI. Uh, the description is genuine garnet, shape and cut, oval cut, garnet color, approximate total carat weight, pendant earrings and bar pin, 3.8 carat total weight. Made in the U.S. So I thought that was really pretty. Um, then I came across this, um, Trafari set. Trafari pieces, um, can go for, uh, quite a bit, 75, 100, 150 or more. Um, these are pearls. They're like a, I don't know. It's like a, has like a gray green to it or bluish gray. Um, the rhinestones look like they have some green in it, but it's a three piece set. I got the bracelet and the earrings and uh, their Trafari crown, crown Trafari, and it's marked on the back. Trafari. Sorry, I can't see too good because the camera's pointing down. But it's marked. It's really pretty. Silver tone. Um, again, it's like a... has like a green color to it. Um, and then here is the, uh, the necklace. So it came with the necklace, the bracelet... And um, the earrings. Um, then I came across this Alex and Annie Energy bracelet from 2012. And it says... Uh, infused with energy technology, charity by design, Alex and Annie, um, a puzzle piece kind of medallion looking thing. I don't know what that's all about, but that's what it is. Okay. Um, so then I came across... Uh, here, let me get these out of here so I could um, make some room. But aren't they beautiful pieces? I was very happy with this um, purchase. We'll definitely get my money back. And a lot more. <laughs> okay, so I moved those all aside so I can make some room. Now I put all these, they're like religious uh crosses like this says um, Native American silver it's a um, cross pendant and then um, some uh, crosses or medallions marked one was France uh, some were Italy um, 
Um, this one was kind of cool. I think this is marked. This is the France one. And then a bracelet. This one was really cool. And then maybe one piece, one of the crosses or pendants were marked, uh, you know, sterling. And then, um, so I put all these into one lot. Here's various crosses and uh, Sunday school. Um, yeah, so just various. So these are all going to be, you know, or they are all in one lot. I'm selling them um, as one. Not all of them are marked. One was France, a couple were Italy, and I think one piece, or no, I have two sterling pieces in here. So that's kind of cool. Um, I, there's this old uh, Lennox box, but they were filled with um, like cufflinks and tie pins and what have you. So those are all 